Hey guys, I want to make this quick video to let you guys know that there is a Crisis 2 config that will enable uh, these features below. Bloom HDR, motion blur, multi-GPU support, multi-core support, full-scale anti-aliasing, use edge anti-aliasing, anisotropic filtering, texture filter, and shadow options, as well as some others for controls and layout. I want to let you guys know this because like in Crisis 1, you get all these options, but Crisis 2, you don't because it's a console port. So, mom, if you want to enable these features to increase your graphic quality, if you have the ability to, definitely go check this out. I'll put the link in the description. Um, but that's basically all I got to say. Uh, yeah, you, I'll show you what it looks like, actually. Let me show you here. You open it up, and you have these options. You have your sound, and your graphics, and you can change the options. So, for example, I want to set the anisotropic filtering and the tropic filtering to 16x boom and then you set the exe path and then basically you go to your crytek crisis demo and 32 and then click your exe there you go I don't want to do this hold on let me close this out Yeah, give me a second. There we go. Now I close it out. <laughs> okay, so it's basically what it is. Um, yeah, go ahead and check it out. Rate, comment, subscribe. Thank you for watching my video. Peace.